My name is Daniel Ball. I'm a machine operator at Hypertherm. I've been here for six years. I'm a MO2 in light industrial and low volume. I'm just going to show you a little introduction to the day-to-day -day doings of a machine operator at Hypertherm. At the beginning of each day, an associate will load different size bar stock into the bar feeder. After the bar stock's loaded, next comes the machining. Different setups might require the changing of different tools, changing of collets, changing of um, stock and work holding. After the tools have been changed and the pressures have been adjusted, now we get to the running of the part. So each part has its own part program using G and M codes. These parts are loaded in from the database and are programmed into the machine to run specific parts with specific dimensions. After the machine has been verified to be in a safe location, uh, the associate can start the cycle and watch as a part is machined on one of our CNC lathes. After the part is machined, the associate will take the electrode to the bench uh, where there is numerous engineering prints, um, inspection data sheet, and different ways to measure the part to make sure it meets the correct size and dimensions of the engineering print. Two or three years ago, associates would have to tray each part individually onto the tray. This was time consuming, but over the last two or three years, we have transitioned to high-end robots that would tray up the parts for the associate. Each robot station can tray up to five trays for the associate, leaving them more time to do inspections, do cleanings, and to be able to run their job more effectively. After the tray has been inspected to meet the engineering prints quality, the associate will take the tray and go down to the wash station. And the wash will completely clean all the parts using oil degreasing chemicals. After the associate takes the parts out of the wash, each part needs to be individually lasered with a part number, a date code, and Hypertherm's logo. And this ensures that the customer knows they're getting the right part, but also in case of um, any issues, the, the date code can tra trace the part back to the production run. After the parts come out of the laser, the associate will bring the parts down to final packaging. This is where the parts will be packaged and placed in boxes to be shipped out to the customer. Each electrode will go in the individual packaging specific to that part number. And they will get a label that will be closed inside the packaging and then placed into the box to the specific um, order quantity. Once the parts are packaged and put into the box, they will be taped up, they will be labeled, and then they will be scanned and sent into um, work order and put on the desk to be picked up for delivery. Thank you for joining us here. Uh, I hope this video helps to help you understand what machine operators do at Hypertherm. If you have any more questions, you can go to hypertherm.jobs. And thank you for joining us, and I look forward to seeing you on the shop floor.